This is a noise reduction box that we built for our 30 gallon non-oiled compressor from Craftsman. When we started building our RV from Vans Aircraft, the noise from the new compressor was so loud that the neighbors started to complain. We knew that we had to do something. So we came up with a design after searching on the internet. Here's the disclaimer. This is not a how-to video, but how we did it video. Use your own judgment when building one of these. First, we start off with a compressor inside a box made of 3 quarter inch plywood or 5 eighths plywood. There is a piece of plywood inside that goes from side to side, and it has a gap at the top to allow air to go over. The outside piece of plywood has a gap at the bottom for air to come in. On the opposite side of the box, there's a bathroom fan, which is reversed to pull air. Above the bathroom fan, there's a light switch that provides power to the compressor and to the fan. When the light switch is turned on, the compressor turns on and so does the bathroom fan. This pulls air through the bottom slit, over the top of the compressor, and out the other side. This setup not only reduces the noise, but keeps the non-oiled compressor cool. Now for a little overkill. We added some styrofoam sheets and foam mattress padding to the inner walls of the box. This added to the noise reduction, so old carpet pieces stapled to the outside of the box didn't hurt either. Here's a shot of the bathroom fan and an access door to get to the drain screw on the bottom of the compressor tank. While we're here, let's take a look at the setup for pneumatic tools. We loop the hose coming out of the compressor to prevent oil from going back into the tank from the pneumatic tools. All the regulators in the line have quick connects. The first regulator shows the full pressure in the tank. The second regulator reduces the pressure for two pneumatic tools. The third regulator reduces the pressure even more for a pneumatic paint sprayer. This setup really saves time when switching tools. Hope you enjoyed this video. Keep pounding those rivets.